DJ Lee from High Pond TV alongside C1 and Lisa Mafia. How's it going, guys? Really good, good, thanks. <laughs> really good. Okay, first question. Um, what brought you to Wales today? Um, the event. I mean, there's there's loads of charities that you can get involved in, but when it actually means something and it's, it's proper, then yeah, I love to do it. Especially performing to kids that really appreciate it as well. So yeah, it's all about the kids. Okay, cool. And where are you both from originally? I'm from South London, North London. Okay, and what made you both um, choose to decide to sort of make music and go down that path? For me, um, I was actually put in a um, this situation. I, I didn't grow up wanting to be a, a, a pop star. It was um, a, another person's dream, it's Mega Man, G Man's dream. But as I've been taken through the stages of building a career out of music, I've begun to love it more and more. <laughs> and you kind of just crave it because music it does pay off when your record sells or when the people are singing back the lyrics where you sat down in your room and wrote a song and then at the end of it everyone's singing it back to you that's a lovely feeling it's a beautiful feeling for me basically i started music like seven years ago i saw the streets where i got a little bit of trouble and decided this was the time to change around i found music when i was up the soul so i didn't need some man from the music this week. Okay, I mentioned to me that you Lisa, and do you find it harder as a female? Do you feel you sort of have to prove yourself more? Or? lucky enough to not have to prove myself. I was the only girl within Soul Solid so I kind of shunned because of that and then meeting up with North Star um, it's it just built built my confidence day by day because they were they were strong artists. North Star are strong artists so it kind of makes you compete against what your own so you, you build yourself up as you go along so I've been lucky enough not to have to prove myself too much. Okay that's cool. Um, obviously everywhere at the moment we've seen since you're in a way um, yes. so it's single. Um, what else have you got planned for you guys? Um, we've got men's clothing and women's clothing. The women's clothing store is called House of Mafia and that's launching in April. And then we have a men's store um, called Ferraducci. www.ferraducci.com.au <laughs> And that's Ferraducci. Okay, cool. Um, and lastly, I'm um, just wondering if you've got any writing moments. My worst embarrassing moment. I think, you know, there was once I was performing in front of 30,000. It was in, um, it was in uh, what was it, Peter, uh, Portsmouth, Peterborough. It was an outside event um, and it was on the beach and it, there was loads of people there. And I thought I was smart enough to go on stage with bubble gum in my mouth. And I actually choked on my bubble gum and had to stop the track and start again. Embarrassing, awful. <laughs> I'm about yourself, and <laughs> 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 um, that's pretty much it for the interview. How can people sort of get hold of you? I know you've got Twitter. We've got the Twitter, that's um, Lisa Mafia UK. We've got Facebook, Lisa Mafia UK. We've got C1 North Star Twitter um, and C1 Facebook and MySpace for C1 as well. And if not, you can check out our clothes www.ferraducci.co.uk and tassamafia.com. Okay, that's it. It's been Hype on TV. Thank you.